Hi, I'm Tony Stefano with Hillside Christmas Tree Farm, and today is October 16th, and I wanted to give an update on that problem area in our Canaan fir field. Um, this is after kind of year one of our attempt to kind of fix that with the soil nutrition, um, adding sulfur and some fertilizer to try to correct some of the yellowness in these trees. We still see still see some yellow. That's expected. This is going to be a couple year process. Hopefully we can get a handle on it before we want to sell these trees, which is probably going to be in about three years. So we'll start shooting them up. Um, I personally think we made an improvement this year. Some are very yellow. Some there are still some, some more green in it. So we'll take a look. That's what's nice about doing these videos is we can see year after year what's going on. I'm sure we kind of talked about this. Uh, project last October I'm hoping so we'll have like a, a kind of seasonal uh, comparison it's good to compare these things at the same time because you know I don't know grass being greener and things like that kind of can skew your uh, <laughs> your judgment a little bit so hopefully we'll continue to work on this and yeah we'll take a walk through the trees see what we see and I kind of kind of see that a little more this way there are some more yellow trees that's not where I went through each row. I thought those trees were a little better, clearly not. Um, next thing we'll do, hopefully next weekend, is we'll pull a soil sample, see if we actually made improvement in our uh, in our soil sample, right? It's gotta be in the dirt for the tree to take it, so hopefully we made improvements there. All right, walking through some of these trees, we still see a lot of yellow, that's expected. This is a multi-year project, like we said. You know, you got like this little ugly duckling that might not turn into anything. But if we take a look at that top, that might become a little top lot tree. So what we do on our farm is we have tops of um, you know, bad trees or anything like that. And we just sell them as small retail trees for the kids. And we call them top lot. We sell them for what, three to five bucks. And that's a big hit. A lot of kids like that. They, they actually have to uh, start growing trees for top lots. But if, yeah, and if you live in an apartment too, some people like them. But as we come into here, we see a definite improvement in some of these trees, which is very exciting. Come back toward the house a bit. And kind of up this way is a lot of yellow. And this is kind of where I didn't, I didn't spread the sulfur and the fertilizer as much. It's pretty easy to tell that there's this road here and I thought a lot of the bad stuff was on the pond side of the road not so far up so next year we'll be sure to hit this section pretty hard give it some juice them up so all right I think that'll do it for this walk thanks again for watching this video I hope you saw something that will help you succeed on your farm if you didn't check out some of these other videos that I've created for you Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any future content. Lastly, if you'd like to support the channel, please consider use, using the Buy Me A Coffee or affiliate links in the description below.